What is up guys, it is Jamie or Double Game here and today I'm going to be showing you one of the best XP strategies I know. This is how to go up a whole prestige in one game. So let's get into it. So as you can see I am prestige master mostly from prestige 7 upwards I've done this method as it is amazing and you will literally level up loads especially in double XP which it was recently. So yeah. So what you need is a parkaholic, and you don't you don't have to have this. If you don't have this, it's okay. You can still do strategy, but it just makes it a lot easier. You don't have to waste money on buying perks. You can just get parkaholic, and you're done. So next thing you need is a shopping free, as you kind of need this, as it will make it a lot easier. You just open up the whole map, and yeah, so it makes it a lot easier. You spend more money on the box, everything. So next thing you need is alchemical, and you need this as you'll be using the apothecary servant. And in case you run out of ammo, you got alchemical got you covered. Self medication is next, as you need this because this, in case you go down, you want to get back up quickly. So yeah, but you, you you can swap this out if you want, as um as you know as you get to the higher rounds, it's hard to get a kill with the ray gun, and that's what you get when you go down with self med. So yeah, so that's what I recommend. And then fire cell you do need as It'll make it a lot easier to get the weapons. You won't spend a ton of money on the box. It'll make it so much easier. So you, yeah, and the more you have, the better. As you won't have to um, like if you you have a lot of fire cells to try and get your weapons. But I usually get them in about one or two. So yeah, um, and yeah, so that's what you need. And yeah, that's my emblem falling up because it rocks. And yeah, so those are the gobble gums you need. And I will see you guys in the video. So hey guys, so as you can see I just got a shopping free here and I like to buy the RK5 quickly just to have a weapon for the keeper and stuff. So what you want to do is just follow the route I'm going. So you want to go from spawn to shang, shang shang. Then you just want to buy this door right here. And I usually get as far as right, but yeah, so then you just want to go down here, go to the right here, and then buy this door. Then I also buy hit this door to the stage here. And it's almost running out, so we need to hurry up here. So yes, yeah, so you just want to go around the side here. So, so you basically, guys, you just want to follow the route I'm going, and it will work every time. You know. And then, so you want to buy this door here. And are we gonna make it? 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 Yes, we can make it. All right. So that's you. That's where you want to get to, because you can't really get to Mob of the Dead as that is just too far. So yeah. So the next step that I like to do is I like to get myself all the way back to spawn, and then yeah. And then after when I get back to spawn, I like to do the first ritual, and so I get myself back to spawn. I do all the all the corruption engines. Sorry. And then once you've done all the corruption engines, um, really you just want to start yeah, doing the key protect and everything, day. but we'll get onto that. So what you want to do is just um, do all the corruption engines and then we'll be on to the next. Okay guys, so next thing you want to do is just stand on all these pads at the horizon. This is once you've done all the corruption engines, stand at all these launch, all these uh, sorry, gravity pads at the horizon. And then you'll know they're done once you see a blue light come from the floor beneath you. And yep, so once they're all done, it will go into gravity mode. And so well, we just last one, there you go. And then what you want to do is run over to this hole over here. And you just throw a grenade in it. Okay, and this will pop out the wolf mask, and you want this to get the jug, to get the no, yeah, to get the other mask, to get the purple jug mask, sir. And once you have the purple jug mask, you will have purple jug, and it will be more hits to down you, basically. So more jug. And how you fill this up is you just get kills near it. So as you can see, blue souls are going in. So that's all you want to do is just get kills near this. And yeah, so done its kill. So as you can see I'm just getting kills near this thing. And yeah, so that is all you want to do for now. And once you do that, you'll hear a wolf mask. You sorry, you'll hear a wolf sound and yeah, that's when you know it's all done. And then once you've done that Okay, so guys, next thing you wanna do is try and get your perkaholic. And as you can see I very lucky and got it first time here. But yeah, so after you do that you want to go on to the next step. 
and I will see you guys in what do you Okay guys, so the next thing you want to do is try and get your emulation out of the machine. And as you can see by the round number, I had to spend it quite a lot of times. But yeah, and you will eventually get it, and so, yeah. Once you do get it, you just want to make your way to a box and start um, and start popping them. Like there's no tomorrow. And then once you have done that, you want to try. These are the guns. Okay, so yeah, these are the guns you want to try and get out of the box. You want to try and get the Apothecan Servant, the Thunder Gun, the Little Arnies, and the Ragnaroks. This is what you need for the setup, and this is what you'll be camping right here. But that is what you need for the ultimate setup and the ultimate camping guys. And also, yeah, on Tactical Apocalypse. And yeah, so once you have got those weapons, um, we'll be on to the next step. Okay, guys, so the next step you want to do is you want to build all the parts for the key protector, so final parts. So, as you can see, that's where they all are. And if you don't know where they are, you can just watch the video on how to and where they all are, but they shouldn't be too hard. So once you actually get all the parts, you just want to come to one of the locations around the map where you build them, construct it here like this, and then what you want to do is just you just pay you have to pay 5k. You don't have to pay it all once. You pay 5k like that, and then the keeper pops out right there, and you need to let him get kills until his like until he's full up. So as you can see, um, when zombies start to come. Um, zombies start to come he will just shoot this little beam of like of just awesomeness at the zombies as you can see there and when he is done he will just disappear and you will notice so yeah one, that, this is to get um, the purple jug by the way guys I didn't make that clear and yeah so once you've done this you will be able to move on to the next step okay guys so so when you um, Finish the keeper. The mask will appear right here. This mask. It's really you cool. cannot see. So you want to pick that up and, as you see, read those things. And yep, that's, that's it. It's everything that does. And yes, yeah, so once um, you've got that, you are ready to move on to the next. So guys, the next step is to upgrade the apartment seven, and to do that, you just shoot these five crystals around the map, they're up in the sky, so you just shoot them like that with the crosshairs and aim in and press fire and yep, you get a little warp on the screen just so you know you've done it and yep, so I'm going to be showing you all the locations, that's the first one next one, you can get this one from Shang or from Drive Knife Brush now the next one is just on the stairs, Shang should look up, right there the next one will be at Varat, actually there are two at Varat, so Yep, you just want to let me get to bar up, and then uh, there's that, and there is also one of the dead, and then, yep, that is the five sets. Yep. <laughs> So next thing you want to do is just open up here, and what you want to do is just wait for the apothecary to come, and you want to track to the Tesla, and I got quite lucky as things came off straight away, but you might have to wait a bit. Hold X to get trapped, and then you wait a little bit, and then you right there as I'm aiming, there you go, you should open up, and you want to just go through, and uh, yep. Uh, hey guys, so the next step you want to do it's just um, upgrade the Apothecary Servant and your Thunder Gun. Um, so, yep, you gotta shoot these things down here. These three things holding Pack a Punch and all of that stuff. You just wanna drop down the side here. And then, yep, you can just go and pack. So, there is that amazing. As they say, too soon. Bing bing. And yep, that is. Okay, guys, so here is the camping spot. So basically, it is literally just this room. You don't want to go past 
about here because this will mess up the spawns. And y you do, you kind, you can have an insta kill weapon, which is what I have. But that's not necessary. But yes, yeah, so you want low Arnie's, um, Ragnaroks, Apothecan, Thunder Gun, and yeah, that's it. Like I said, so so you don't want to go past these spots. And then what you want to do is basically just sit in these corners. You can like train around for like a second or two, but there will be a lot more zombies in higher rounds, guys. So basically, you just want to sit in this corner here. The zombies will come through, and like I'm doing now, you just want to shoot the Apothecan Servant. It won't charge you up fully right now because it's on a low round, but when this is on high rounds, it'll work properly. So, yep, so you just charge it, and then, yeah, so it's charged, and then once it's fully charged, you just want to use the Ragnaroks and kill the zombies with them, and then another Apothecan Bullet, and then that will charge the Ragnaroks, and yep, so on. So. That is the method, and I hope you guys enjoyed the video. If you did, please smash that like button. And sorry I haven't been uploading. I mean, not many people watch me, but I, I know there are some people. So sorry I have not been uploading. But um, I will be uploading a lot more, like one video a week. So for the people who are watching, tell me what you want, what you want to see in the comments below. Or if you just not even sub, you just want to um, stop by, just tell, tell me what you want to see, and I'll post it. And yeah, so. Hope you guys enjoyed. Try this method out with your friends. And give me a sub. And I'll see ya.